All right, hello. Welcome to another Operation with Squad Ops, Operation Chain Link. I'm Killer Man Time, and I'll be your commentator for the night. And I'm just going to keep this all short and simple and just bring y'all straight into the uh, commands and loadout. So, commands for round one. If I can change my slides, there it goes. Uh... Command for round one, we have Russia and the militia. Uh, for the Russian side, we'll be commanded by Silas, his 2IC being Phoenix, and his three other SLs being Adukin, Skies Chap, and Fulcrum. Uh, for the militia side, we have Londarts with his 2IC being Alpha Guido, his three other SLs being Frost, Jackson, and Revy. And with that out of the way, we'll now go over the team loadouts. First up is the Russian side. Infantry squad levels 1 SL, 2 F, or 1 SL, 1 at LAT, 1 Medic. Platoon level is 6 ARs, 4 MGs, 4 ammo bearers. Vehicles consist of 2 BTR 80s, 2 trans trucks, uh, no fobra logistics, and support consists of 2 artillery smoke barrages. And for the militia side, we are looking at infantry squad level, 1 SL, 1 AR, 1 LAT, 1 Medic, 4 Engineers for platoon level, 2 HATs, and 2 Ammo Bearers. Uh, vehicles consist of 3 Logies, 2000 build, 500 ammo each, with 2 HMGs, and various defensive structures for the FOB. Uh, Alright, so now we'll just go to the up map. And we will do a brief go over the objectives. For the Russian side, the objective is destroy and occupy the mill fob at uh, in 1026 until dusk. Or I'm not even sure if we really have a timeline on that, but it says until dusk. Um, which I believe that fob should be noted on that map there as the green little fob marker for the militia. And for the militia, their objective is fortify and defend the FOB position at in 1026 until dusk once more. It's pretty straightforward. One's attacking, one's defending. If one loses all their forces, they lose. If the other loses all their forces, they also lose. It's, uh, very easy. Anyways, I'm gonna bring y'all in. Y'all can listen to the uh, commands go over their weird, weird command stuff. All right, everyone, go and open up your maps. Uh, I'm going to go through the quick concept of the operation. So our objective is obviously to destroy an enemy militia encampment. Uh, we know they're set up somewhere on the southeast side of uh, Stepney. So to do this, we're going to split into two elements. We're going to keep one consolidated platoon element, which is going to consist of Adakin squad, uh, Fulcrum squad as infantry, and then Scottish is going to be with BTR support. And then Phoenix squad will be slightly detached, providing security for the rest of the platoon. Uh, we're going to convoy up to approximately the helmet mark in November 861. Uh, the platoon's going to dismount there. Phoenix's guys are going to break off westward and dismount approximately at the BTR mark at Mike 852. Um, from there, we'll proceed south with the infantry leading in front of the vehicles. We're going to do a quick sweep of the village. We're not clearing buildings, but we're kind of poking our head around making sure there's no enemy elements hiding inside, laying in wait to set an ambush. Uh, once we clear this area, we're going to continue south to our assault staging positions. Uh, Phoenix's squad will be set up on the BTR mark in the southwest at approximately Mike 1027. They'll be providing southwestern security, preventing the enemy from moving west to east along the tree line that we're going to be assaulting through. Uh, similarly, Scottish squad is going to be moving to November 9 to 3. They'll be setting up a base of fire position there in those clusters of rocks with their BTR in support. Uh, and again, they'll be preventing the enemy from moving northeast to southwest in that tree line. Uh, that is our objective. Adikin squad will be staging at the gas station in Mike 1099. And Fulcrum squad will be set up just behind Scottish's team at November 9 to 5. Uh, they will be the primary assaulting elements, and once our security elements are set in place with the vehicles acting as a base of fire, uh, they will begin moving up the uh, ridge lines. I'll mark them. 
these using these little berms as cover as best they can under the cover of smoke barrages to get into that tree line uh and they're going to push consolidate and push north to south in the main trench and secure the radio once we secure that radio and the surrounding area we're not pushing any further south to engage the enemy we're holding that line uh phoenix's squad and scottish's squad will remain at their positions providing a base of fire making sure that enemy flanking elements don't maneuver through that tree line late round to flank our elements that are attacking the point if we sustain heavy casualties in the initial assault we'll consider pulling scottish's squad off first uh and then phoenix's squad if need be uh to kind of fortify the assault at this time is there any questions all right excellent squad leaders go ahead and get them breaking out uh mount them up and get ready for live all right we are live gentlemen that's good good luck yeah let's... i don't know why yeah. waiting for the uh the tr80s we should we probably moving? get moving right is, it, is there a hold up? We're alive. Negative, negative. That's actual live. Sorry, sorry. One said anything to me. Yeah. Uh, someone's not paying attention. Ah, yes. Live free or live. I did that. Yeah, live hard. Okay. Oh boy. Off to glory they go. Lead transport. Oh my god, what did I... I hit like this weird ditch. Infantry, you're good to go ahead and start moving into Stepney and Clearing. Looks like the militia forces are not quite that close, but close enough. Could start wrecking Before havoc. You could go a bit east or a bit west of two, and kind of walk down the left road to make sure they're not over there. Looks like we've got Alpha Guido's crew moving down along the road towards one of the BTR 80s and it's a little complement of soldiers. Hmm, you know what? I think I forgot to do something. Hang on. Yeah, that should be a lot less bright. There you go. One, be cautious that village to your southeast with the BTR. Come here. I have no idea when we got a night bot, but uh, okay.
in rocks, November 923, and in the surrounding woodland. Copy that. You need TR to support. No need to rush it. Just get frags up there and clear them out of those rocks. We're, we got a ways to go till Phoenix is online, so just use your BTR as a support. Fulcrum. Go for Fulcrum. I want you to move east through the trench line and set up at November 963 and act as a blocking element for any flanking forces until one takes his position. Copy that, 963. Just kind of spread your guys out in that trench. Please don't be the front. He's too slow. Uh, one, this is command. Because about 30 seconds ago, there were people standing. I got movement at Oscar 913 in the tree line. Possibly a hat looking at your BTR or something. Just have him keep an eye on his left flank. Copy that. Command, this is two. Go for command. Contact on the gas station, Mike 10. Copy that. Just set up in positions to engage them. Wait for three to get up online with their BTR, and the BTR will be able to pick them off. Roger, man. Push your BTR to two's west side near the village and have it support the gas station attack. This is this is for yep. we have enemies at the town Oscar nine two five. Copy that for. Just keep your guys spread out there and make sure they don't move from there. Squad one for command. Go for command. Uh, BTR has been hit once. Down 25%. Copy that. Nice little trades here and there, but it looks like the militia forces are more keen on falling back from their forward points than they are holding on to them. Commands two. Go for command. 2k on the uh, gas station. There's two contacts at least south of the gas station. Mike 10, 9 1 in the trenches. Copy. Three's uh, BTR is getting online soon. Oof. Song got a nice last shot there. And copy. We'll take the dirt road. Yeah, it looks like Fluffs McGruffs pulling out the lat to take out the HMG. Squad one to 
Go for command. I wouldn't say we're really suppressing them, more surviving. I understand. Once, uh, once we get staged for the assault, I'll have you pull your BTR behind you to keep your heads down a little more. Uh, we'll, we'll get a little more aggressive with our fire. This is for contacts that were to the southeast. I've lost track. Copy that for uh, here in a minute or two. Three is going to be in position, and I want you, whenever that ha when I give the call, I want you to pull southwest to get behind one and get ready to assault up their berm. Whenever I give the order. So squad one's contact reports are uh, basically a HMG direct south uh, enemy in the trench line to our southeast and enemy infantry to our southeast in the tree line. Copy. I'm going to I'm going to drop the smoke barrage kind of towards the end of the arrow near that little barn and get a wide dispersion so hopefully that can get four and two up close uh, and you can hopefully get some fire on them. Man, this is like we got another person Command on the HMG. Contact to our southeast. Do you still want us? Was it was Sergeant Jackson. Probably a good thing he yeah, got off of it because that lap came in to take a order, nice hit. To move. Copy that. Command three is ready to step off. Copy. Go ahead and see three. Go ahead and seize that village to your south, uh, and get firing yeah, positions there. Four, go ahead and start initiating movement behind squad one. This is far moving. Reloading. Push up, push up to these bushes. Alright, all squads get ready to prep for assault. The smokes are going down shortly. Okay. Scottish, can you get me a mark on that barn? Uh, if I get shot in the face by HMG, I'm going No, to I got it, I got it. Don't worry about it, I got it. Copy that. Назначен новый командир. Smoke barrage got called. It should be coming down soon. Whenever the smoke start hitting, uh, I want both of you to initiate movement. Squads two and four. One and three, I want you suppressing that tree line as best you can while still maintaining security. Command three, objective secured. We have enemy infantry likely to our southwest up in the ridge line, as well as the infantry east on target. Copy that, three. One, go ahead and get BTR in a position they can get fire superiority on that objective. Smoke's coming in shortly. Smokes initiate movement. One and three start suppressing. Where are the smokes? They're gone. There they Get in there, two and four. Oh. 
You can't wait too long. That smoke will dissipate faster than you can move. It may have waited too long. Which means they're going to be caught out in the open with nothing. Alright, smoke's starting to fade. Get to that tree line and then get, get in firing positions as soon as you hit the trees. Happy, I'm right behind you, buddy. Lagos, Lagar are gonna get hit by it. Lagar's trying to move. No, he did not get away from it. Nice toss by Happy Glamper. Sir SPT getting pushed by Fulcrum. Fulcrum trying to bandage. Sir SPG or SPT is. Tossing smokes up front, not a good choice. Chilled getting knocked out. Liberal so also getting poked. Progress, but we're taking losses. Copy that. Fulcrum trying to take out Sir SPT. Sir SPT just lobbing bullets, hoping he hit something. Fulcrum hitting mostly the tree. Does not look like Sir SPT fully knows where he is. Fulcrum tossing smokes. Drawing lead to try to secure that barn as soon as you're able. And Fulcrum oh, taken out down. by Sir SPT. Squad four. Oh, I didn't even notice that in the rear there. Through the field, crawl if you have to, get to the north side of that barn. Three, give me a status report when you're able. Three, I contact towards southeast. That's in between myself and two, likely south of two at this time. Copy, that's a good line to engage them at. Looks like the eastern militia group is now moving down the tree line. To reinforce the center here, where uh, Liberal and Hedda are currently the only Russian force up forward. And that's another lat or a hat on the BTR-80. BTR-80 tossing out one last smoke before they bail. Toasty getting pegged. Esteban taken out. Toasty still alive. But he's bleeding. Copy one focus on security on that eastern element. Two and three. You guys are Liberal taken out by Sir SPT. Does not look like the Russian push is quite panning out. We have enemies uh, to our east. They are shooting into our position. Two contact southwest. Got it, yes. How much health are we at? Uh, Still. Yeah, it sounds like those contacts are Oscar 10 7. The like Duke and just there. slowly poking them out. Two, you have contact with Phoenix. Copy three. Two, don't get too engaged on the south there. I want you moving east. Three, they're on my southwest as well, I believe. Just to your south, southeast. They're on some sort of elevation heading your way. Looks like Hedda is currently in a slow push for this central building with Nick. You I'm sorry, back, not covering back, the east back, was kind of dumb. 
Squad 4, be advised. Enemy direct serve with us. Just cross the trench line to your east. Which direction were they heading? Uh, towards you. Copy. Also heard some to our uh, south. Right, we need to try to reconsolidate on this north tree line. We're getting pretty thinned out. Phoenix, what map for us? Three, whenever you're comfortable, reposition kind of northeast towards two's position and two position east between you and four. We have a second smoke barrage call on, so if you need it to maneuver, let me know. And Phoenix taking out Efang, leaving assault Command, all on his own over here, to east at the trying to take out to the BTR-80. The BTR-80 BTR is hot on his trail. And the BTR takes out assault. And it looks like the Russian forces have managed to take the western portion of the militia forces area. Clean up what you got, and then... Find a position to maneuver back. So they are in prime position to push Scroll from the side now. Go for command. We have eyes on enemy infantry north. Trying to flank them. Copy that. Uh, reposition however you need to. I want you to ambush those guys. They're going to try to use the trenches either to your north or northeast. Copy that. What, command, what grid were they? Confirm. You, want a, you want a full platoon line on the northern side of the objective? Yes, I want you to support two and maneuvering to the north side of the objective. I don't want to overcommit to that south because we're we're getting spread out what here. About, are we okay? And we're negative on approaching from the west. Uh, you can approach from the west. Yeah, if you think you can make it work, go for it. I don't want to go from the south though. I mean, you think it's, you there is some uh, confusion somewhere. I don't think we have anyone on the south. Do you have a grid on that contact? You saw north? Uh, no, I got a uh, very wayward call. He said he didn't know if it was movement or if it was a leaf. <laughs> Technically, right now would be the perfect time to straight push it. I understood. Two, take point. One, uh, you're going to start moving through the gas station the Route 2 took and pull in behind them. Just keep rear security. Command be advised, I got eyes on the dish cup. Next to the barn. Yeah, copy. Feel free to utilize it if you can seize it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bragging out. Is... Oh, east of the lodgy. Yeah, there's a squad leader. Keep pushing. Another frag's coming in. Two, two more frags coming in. Hmm, down goes the Dukin. Uh, this is two uh, cells down. There's contact on top of us. Copy that, too. One's coming to try to reinforce you. Just slowly work your way up. We're converging on the north end of that trench. Don't look away, keep looking. He's there. You can do it, Blue Jericho. Take out Ravi. No, what are you doing? He's right there. Once we get one up a little closer to two, I'm going to drop another smoke barrage at the entry to that trench, and we're going to start pushing in. Three, make sure you synchronize with that however you can. Oh, command, is that smoke dropping on the objective proper? If I can get it there, yeah. Got it. I may need a uh, call-in point from you, Phoenix, if you got a line of sight. Or any, anyone who has a line of sight, do a commander call-in on that trench, and I'll call in that smoke. That's as close as I can get that. That'll work. Mm, 
Mm, down goes all one day. See them, but they're close. All right, smoke barrage is called. It should be about 20 to 30 seconds. Whenever that smoke starts hitting, we're gonna start pushing in. Just get in the objective area and then hard point, and we'll work from there after the smoke barrage ends. I'm gonna place myself with my only guy left. We're gonna try to get into the barn. Copy that. Well, at least they're looking, they're watching each other's backs. Oh, see, has he seen them? How have you, do you, do you see them? There he goes, finally. Sorry, three visors, contact between okay. us and four. I hear them crawling, I think, to the south. I heard something move, unless that was you. Yeah, this could be bad. We've got uh, Sharpie, yeah, Silent, smoke, so and Sasa are taking a wide southern bushes, route, trying to get behind the Russian forces. And they are probably going to manage it, but can they get by Nightmare? I think we get contacts on our northeast. Head, it just went down. This is round one of Operation right, Chain Link. You gotta. That's probably gonna be the safest bet. And we got smokes coming down on the main point. Russian forces all up in the militia forces grill. Get Alva Guido camping right next to the BTR-80. And Nightmare still alive, even though he had Silent Sharpie and Sasa on his rear. And aside from Alpha Guido and those other three, uh, looks like the Russian forces have taken technically the uh, bottom half of the objective. And a frag has just taken out three Russian forces. Remember, spacing is very important. All right, we've got Rather Scratch Chap and Fluss McGruffs. Scratch that, just Fluss oh, McGruffs with Evan SMA on point alongside Londarts. Londarts in a cheeky position here. Dang. Oh, fuck. And I take that back on the Evan SMA. He is not there anymore. Oh, he is. Fluffs is basically sharing his oxygen with Londarts here. And Londarts taking the... Uh, Check to come right out and knock out fluffs. And a loud hit on the BTR 80. I'm sure that was a hat there. BTR 80 is not having it. Keep backing us out. Keep backing us out. DTR-80 on a quick retreat. Russian forces have been trimmed down to Blue Jericho, Matt Honcho, BTR-80 crew. Is Nightmare even alive anymore? No. So that's the Russian crew. And for the militia side, we've got Sir SPT, Sergeant Jackson, uh, Londart's on objective. Seer, Alpha Guido, Sasa, Silent, Sharpie, and... I think that's it. That is it for the, uh, militia side. Between them and... the militia. Alright, let's, uh, let's push in to the point. Objective is that the Russians must so take over as 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 this little fob area. And, then and kind of the guys. objective for the They'd militia is to defend this fob to area. Right, drop off here. Got it. Hold, hold, hold. Go back a bit, go back a bit. That was good depression. So far, the militia forces haven't quite stop, fully stop. lost Perfect. the objective no, yet. Going right there. Back up, back out, back out, back up, back up, back up. Keep backing up. I want you to go down to the, uh, down to the south. I want you to go into that ditch. We're going to go and gotcha. find this guy. Do it before Blue Jackal and all that. Nice, Matt Hondo coming around the corner and taking them out. Drive fast, fast. Got it. 
We've got Sasa and Silent taking a long southeast east push. Lawn Darts is the only one on point once more. Uh, we've got Sergeant Jackson and Sir SPT to the north. Does anyone know what the fob radio is? I'm assuming keep going south. I can dig down this barbed wire, we can keep going south. Yeah, dig it down, dig it down. We're trying to watch our northwest, down this trench. North, and then back around. There's one more guy out okay. there somewhere okay. over the way. So like, do big, big loops. Just imagine doing big loops around these guys. Yeah, yeah. But just... I wonder, do either one of these... Uh-oh. This could end badly for Madman Pete and Ronnie. Oh, looks like they stopped. Silent is just waiting for him to come back around. Oh, lovely. Just bushes everywhere. <laughs> Keep going, yeah. keep going, no depression. Russian forces thinking that there might be some uh, militia forces in the woods down to the southeast south. And we're getting a radio in saying the Russians must take radio in November 10 to 6. And this could be Wait, a yeah, bad yeah, move. Good. Yeah, it's in that trench we Cross were in, gun. just no, like inside of it, just going. So we're gonna drop him again, and then we're just gonna keep covering you, okay? Yep. There's at least that one. Guy so that silent missed his shot. South is under lake. Yep. Southeast. Southeast. Copy. Just flip around. We'll get armor. Hey, hey, guys, guys, this is this is the M and M. So you guys are the only one left. You guys need to attack this radio that's in this trench line. Okay? Copy. Copy. If you need to position your thing and get out, that's fine. You need to attack. Alright! Never mind. You can't get out no more. Don't talk. Don't talk. Don't talk. And that's the end of it. Alrighty then. Well, with them dead, that is pretty much end of round one. And we'll be right back with round two. Alright guys, great job. Great job the first round. That was uh, a really good defense. Got pretty close there towards the end. Uh, I suppose everyone can see how key Same. the BTR-80 assets are. But uh, we did really well there to uh, hold off the, the Russians first round. So second round, we're the Russians. Our mission is to uh, find all the partisans down there by the farm in November 10 and kill them, take out their uh, their outpost. Uh, their outpost is going to be very, very close to the uh, mark that I'm laying down in November 10 to 6, similar sort of position that uh, we're in last round. In order to uh, achieve that mission, uh, we've got Revy squad that's uh, kind enough to take the two BT-80s, transporting Jackson and Guido squad to a uh, drop-off point somewhere around Juliet 9, Kilo 9. From there, those uh, three squads will be moving uh, east to get the BTRs in a position on the hill in Lima 10 5 7. Jackson squad's going to be Northern Security, and uh, Guido squad will have the Southern Security. My intent there is to put suppressive fire onto the buildings I'm marking with uh, helmet markers, generally get the militia's attention, and try and bait out a, uh, a lat uh, or two to, to try and flank us. Maybe they'll send a squad to flank from the north or the south. Um, my hope there is that we can uh, take that squad out because we'll have a uh, three to one advantage in terms of uh, squads and then move on the point. If the militia don't take that particular bait uh, and we've been up on that hill for a few minutes and nothing seems to be going happening, we'll either keep pushing to the east or we'll mount back up in the APCs, use them to their best effect for mobility and uh, assault elsewhere. Now elsewhere may be determined by Frost Squad. They've got recon, they're gonna be dropping in Juliet 12 and then uh, scouting for us the uh, southwest part of the uh, objective for a possible uh, insertion using the BTRs with the other squads. Once we get close, 
uh, command assets are two times smoke barrage, so I can uh, definitely use those. Once they goes down, we only get two, so um, you got to move. When that smoke hits, you got to move. Got to get aggressive. You got to get into a new position, clear it out of uh, militia. Uh, definitely, you don't want to uh, just lay prone and let that smoke dissipate, uh, and then you're left basically with no uh, concealment to get up on on the militia's position. Any questions? All right, uh, have fun, guys. Remember to play for uh, your bloodies, play for your fire team leaders and your squad leaders, and uh, have fun. Squad leaders, break them out. But just give me your address, bro. I'll grab the beer for you. Oh, God. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'm going to be back in 30 seconds. <laughs> Calm down. 28, 27. And, oh, oh, and we are live. Oh, damn, called it like that. What are the odds? Woo. Live for That's round okay. two. Need head start anyway. Operation Chain Link. He was probably in spectator mode. All right, I'm back. Somebody to go in. Right, welcome back. Cross as you get started. Uh, <laughs> that you want to talk about. I don't know why, but the spectator mode. Yeah, there we go. Command, in case you're not tracking, our BTR driver, aka Revy, is momentarily I'm back. He just came back. Roger. See, they won't know where the second BTR is. Oh, they don't even Alright, uh, chain of command, uh, Alpha 2 I see again, then we'll go uh, Jackson, Frost, Revy. Damn it. Apparently you can get in the commander seat and sing now without a, a crewman kit. Crewman? Yeah. Which is nice. Holy fuck. We're breaking the sound barrier. Yeah, we're sued. Pedometer's not even working. It says zero. Taking the long road, can I take the shortcut? Oh my goodness, we just drifted a BTR. Oh my god. Uh, it's time to catch up. Infantry's got dismount, etc. So, um, be safe versus sorry. Give me something to shoot. I'm making a bet. Not really like five so, uh, intelligence coming in. There's an RPT unit down there in uh, Kilo 8. So, given that you've got an open like container, today. probably best to follow the convoy. <laughs> Wait, who's called out? Uh, RPG team is Kilo 8. Right in breath test unit uh, down Sorry, in Kilo 8. Getting okay, up onto the point. Oh, you're away. You missed the whole Revy King abuse thing. Honestly, I'd feel safer heading there on foot. I don't want to get popped uh, while on this okay. thing. Just just here, then? Besides, we yeah. gotta wait a while for the other fucking your other BTR to get here, so I'll just head on foot. Good deal, bro. Good luck. Affirmative. Yeah, you too. Why does this PKM feel so weird? I'm gonna get us north. Feels like it's missing. It nah, it's, I think it's because it has like a carry it's handle fun. on it. Be 
vehicles or heavy armor, so you can use either on infantry. Isn't free? Yeah, I was gonna say, isn't the frag for infantry? The frag is yeah. for infantry. Alright, let's make sure we got the infantry supporting the BTRs as we get up in position. Make sure we got good northern and southern security for the vehicles. So you could bonk one over the head with the AT round. Make it useful. Alright, uh, we're gonna hop out here, guys. Fuck. Alright, one time's pitch out down. Contact east of three. Already got engagement between the mill and the Russians. So the Russians have already lost one of their BTR Jack, 80s. Can you communicate with um, Ethank? If he's not suppressing, he'll need to get out of there. I think. Um, oh no, Madman Pete's gonna be taking all of Bartok's positions here. Ethank's gonna go down if he can't, takes another hit. Hey, three, oh, it's probably not. Here. That's a lat. So. Guys off. I don't want to lose a BTR for uh, nothing. Let's make sure we uh, crush whatever's come out of here to get us. I can't see. Three recommend you push. They're definitely uh, falling back at this point. Three, I need you pushing east in pursuit. Ah, oh, fuck, it's Jackson Town. It's okay, Doom, I need you moving your guys east. Another strike, we're trying to fall back. Uh, at least two times KIA from my squad, possibly more. Roger. Uh, situation is obviously we're down one BTR and we've only got a uh, driver in the BTR. I think it's salty seed. being the lone militia here in the back line. Just, Evan, just make sure you look uh, south, southeast. Uh-huh. You, you gotta cover our back. Command, we're still on mission. Are you up right now? I am, yeah. Just organizing assault coming back in to uh, crew our own bit here. Copy that. Are we uh, changing up the mission plan or does it Evan, still remain the same with the one BTR? Or, uh, southeast. Um, yeah, it's not the same. Uh, that's for sure. Plan A out the window. You got any contact you're walking to yet, Guido? Negative. I believe all enemy contact f fell back northeast from us. Northeast from you, Roger. All right, Jackson, can you? Uh, oh, sorry, Doom. Can you get your guys to hold there, get security? I'm going to send the remaining BTR up to you guys and pick you up. Yeah, Roger. Command, be advised. Most of the enemy infantry contact, they most likely pulled back northeast, so they're probably east of three at this point, maybe falling back into the town now.
Be advised, also got contact on my east side of the road. Roger. All right, so three, the BTR is going to head to pick you up. It's going to redeploy you southwest of squad five. Five, if you could sort of just hold your ground, generally speaking, until three repositions. Three, you copy? Yeah, copy. We'll call. All right, BTR, coming to you, picking you up, going to drop you kilo 1188 southwest of five. And then we're going to have the BTR between five mm, and three. So the fox tried taking out Sasa. So how are you doing over there? Any uh, contact on you yet? No, nope, no contact. I'm about to spread my guys guys out. I'm going to start moving north here in about 30 seconds. All right, Roger. Be advised, I got contact on my position. Uh, very close. Most likely lone infantry in a bush somewhere. Roger, do you think you can push through it, or should we uh, maybe all move over to Frost's location? I would be. I would feel much better uh, relocating and aggressively pushing from the south. All right, you want to peel back to the west. I've got the transport here. If you can just, you know, leave some dude shooting east, peel back to the west. Meet me near, uh, just west of the crossroads. Cut. Uh, squad three. If you can let the BTR know new location for you to be taken, um, yeah. I want you dropping southeast of Squad Four, about 200 meters southeast of Four. I'm fucking one I'm half scared APC right now. Too. BTR, you're going to be taking us. Hey, man, this is Salt. I got command comms for BTR. All right, sweet Salt. You're going to be dropping uh, Squad Three, about 200 meters southeast of Four, so that ideally they don't hear your uh, BTR audio. Copy all. Avoid roads. Avoid uh, rockets. Frost, are you able to get a tactical request for me anywhere in November 10? I want to drop smoke just to get them uh, panicking a bit. Balance the maneuver. Let me see how far I can get that. Anywhere in November 10 is good, I can adjust it. Talk about a perfect mark on the first try, huh? Drop this to the uh, north east of the objective. Maybe try and pull them that way. They shouldn't at you, Guido, at where you were. Uh, yeah, they might have sent us pulling back. I don't know. They might have just seen some of us running back. Roger. That's not, a, I don't feel comfortable pushing up that area, especially when by myself. I'm down to five effective, not including me. All right, so once you get this trans truck, no I want you to deploying over uh, to like uh, October 11, sort of area, pop 11, and then push effective from the southeast. Sounds good. And Assault's crew has probably just tipped off the militia forces that the Russians are coming from the south of their FOB. Alright, squad three and squad four. You'll get that is not going to be good. Support. I've got one time smoke left. There's obviously a sizable force that uh, Alpha's leaving behind somewhere around the sort of Lima 10 sort of area. Alright, I spot movement and sandbags um, basically on the bottom lip of that uh, smoke mark we have down. So basically, that ditch, that's our objective actually. Roger Frost, if you can have a buddy piss specifically watching your west, because those guys are going to come back from your west. Uh, once three gets up online with you, start suppressing the uh, daylights out of that position and assault it with three's help. And that was one time smoke. Roger smoke. that.
Commanders three wrapping around the east side. Like you want me backing four up in this pool, or how do you want me? Uh, you're gonna come in southwest of four and look to screen contact, uh, attacking him from his west. The guys you were just fighting, or you can deploy with three and uh, hit the objective on mass. I'll leave it up to you. Uh, we'll deploy looking west of four, and then we'll if four gets chewed up, we'll go in as a reserve, I guess. Roger. I'm gonna walk it in a similar direction, so if I get killed, you know why. in the best condition yep. we can possibly be I swerved around in. it! Oh shit, I'm glad you're alive, that would've been... <laughs> Brother, Dang, Lodgy <laughs> almost... That. What the fuck? Almost got How poked alive, by, bro. uh... AT yeah, no, mine. No, right. Right, they I'm may have noticed that mine disappeared. <laughs> Make sure to take ammo I support need three and four ammo. if you could. Just, just right. get in there, get on the objective. Yeah, Copy that. Fuck me, that, that... <laughs> <laughs> We're moving up north. Alpha getting the lucky there. Be able to but it's possible be a base of fire that the uh, militia will now think that an entire group of train. Russians have been taken uh, out by an AT mine. Uh, frost whenever you, whenever you want it, whenever you're in position to start assaulting. Uh, it's very yeah, unlikely that a uh, vehicle would survive an AT explosion. Assault, once the smoke goes in, there might be a uh, cue for you to get the BTR right up in their face. Might make it harder for them to get minimum arming distance on you. Good copy. Mark's down. Roger. So, right, smoke's gonna so go just in. Just to make sure, once the smoke hits, you want my squad to attack, yes? Yeah, gain ground. You don't necessarily have to take them all. Well, it's taken out by Esteban. Alright. Gonna hold on that smoke. Mark over. taken out by Kimchi. Esteban also taking some Kimchi. shots from Where's Kimchi. Oh, we're experiencing contact the southeast. Uh, southeast. Roger. All right, Guido, southeast of four. That's uh, for you to take care of. I'm going to hold off on the last uh, smoke request. You've also got a sizable force to your west somewhere coming back from uh, fighting us there at the beginning. Copy that. Not much visibility on any of the uh, militia forces to the south. So you have eyes to like the west, southwest. Quito, you're the only one I think left who can get a uh, command request in for me. Can you drop something anywhere in November 10th at the moment before you go in? Yeah, give me a sec. Thanks. I'm kind of keeping it minimal. Oh, down goes Sam Sasquatch. Sam Squanch. By Awendi or a Lemon Sledge. Alright, perfect. Looks like someone tossed a nade. Barely hurt uh, right, Fulcrum, but looks like Happy Clankers are not doing too good. A fire team, or even just a buddy pair over there on those buildings. The rest of you I want moving west on that smoke as far as you can get, even if you have to crawl in the grass. And we've got a lat out taking out. Roger that, Wilco. I uh, did not catch that name. Sam is taken out also. Got yeah, lats, hats, and uh, grenades being tossed hey, everywhere. On my pause, just north of me, in between me and four. Copy. No, we'd get hit. Gotcha. All right, squad three and assault on this. Use their defenses then to hold off to the north and southeast. Once you get in on their defenses. All right, we lost the BTR. And down goes the BTR-80, taken out by. Who has the ladder? Guido, right can you clear that four, contact with the assault down? Guys, break, break, four, pull your western guys back in. Let sure my guys uh, deal with your west right now. Copy that. Isn't toasty. Also, be advised you have contacts to your east as well. Someone got them. Southeast of you, most Someone likely. Someone in that crew there. Uh, Guido, can, you get you, four. can you get your two guys up on the rocks to suppress the. Uh, and here comes the smoke for the Russians. You need to assault the location on that smoke with three. And it sounds like the Russians are going to just go ahead and take the assault on the fob. Alright, falls down. Four, you got contact 
south of you. If you can hold that till the rest of your guys using that smoke to get on the objective through it. We've got no one pushing towards the fob right now. Four, you need to push now, bud. Go, just get your guys moving. Which I just took over, I just took over. Roger, north. North, five's gonna take care of contact to your south. If you can, get your guys moving on the objective in the smoke, north. Alright, here they go. Not much moving, but they're moving. And they're gonna lose that smoke real fast here. And there it goes. Ghost not in the greatest of positions here. Made out. Looks like it's gonna land not quite on target. I'm coming up on your uh, south. I'm gonna push a bit further east of you. Copy. There's contacts all mixed in between me and four right now. Roger. Definitely need to keep four, them. I recommend uh, you leave like a buddy team just looking. You're watching your south because you're gonna have guys probably between us. Matt, how did you even get, get out here? In the direction of that contact and keep them down. Oh, Nate in there. He's doing some damage here and there. I don't know where the contact is exactly. Sniller is on top, blew up. He said it was right on his paws just before he died. Copy. We're just gonna we're just gonna sweep through and deal with these fuckers, and then we'll help. Uh, okay. We're on the push. Guys, I'm gonna get on line with you on your east. Three's down, by the way. It's, you think is... smokes are gonna help you take out that HMG? Matt getting right up on the line here. Looks like he's gonna try and dig down the. Uh, uh, Barb here. Hopefully they're not going off. We go west. Fulcrum trying to hold off the bottom here in the south. Alongside Chilled. Chilled not taking it so well with Ranger Jaxus uh, taking him out. Down goes Fulcrum also. South of the fob is neutralized and poor Matt has been taken out finally but he did get through the barbed wire. We're on OBJ right now. Uh, a lot of contacts just crawling around the uh, sandbags but we're clearing them out. Roger, awesome. If you can hold your ground there I'm going to try and get uh, comms with three and get them to assist you. Hey, from Looks like uh, Ranger people. and Inject Ghost and me, are making their way up the line. Slowly but surely making their way up. Good, was that you shooting to my west or is that them shooting at you? That was me shooting. I'm just firing at bushes. I have no idea where these fuckers are. Roger. See here, there is only one person left in the forest down here and that is Lemon Sludge who is just taken out by... Uh, this machine hugs. I say one, but actually there is Madman Pete and who is the other one? Paradox. Alright, so maybe with the remnants of three, let's contact up to their north northwest. I'm going to use them to suppress that while you guys uh, do the best you can do on the uh, objective there. Alright, Slay, so we're going to go east and then north. Actually, we're going to go a little south. Oh, down goes Captain America. Ranger is the only one. Oh, lads. Not really hitting anything, but did not expect that explosion in my face. Ranger making his way out into the uh, field. Probably going to be a good choice because there's a lot less things for them to ping a uh, lad off of. Anyone have comms? Yeah, the man's still here. Um, just to, if you can, keep on getting your guys to push onto that Paradox objective. Paradox is the only one left in the forest to the south. The three's moving through the field, they're crawling to your north Inside Soviet you Piggy and Jam oh on God, the Russian push, side. Uh, yeah, uh, Jam making a push well, up. Just push north, do the best you can do. Down 
Paradox making a mad dash right up the uh, creek bed here. Uh, not really a creek, but do you hear what my point is? Be suppressing. Okay, well, everyone's blind today. That's okay. And we've got James, or Jam and Ranger making some smoke tosses. Trying to create some cover so they can possibly push in. Four suggestion report in the app. There we go, two man assault team here. For the left. Situation report. Find us. Jam is a bit busy here. Paradox taken out by Jam. Yeah, him. Okay. Throwing another smoke. Right. To our left. Alright, you're pretty covered in smoke. Right. I'd make that Copy move that. if you got it. Okay. Ah, fuck, they're throwing frags. I got a bandage. Woo! You good? Yeah, I'm good. I'm gonna just see if I can back off and lay down suppressing fire. Just distract them and shit. Oh, Lat comes in and takes out both James and or Jam and Ranger. That is what is left of the Southern crew for the Russians, other than Soviet Piggy. Albeit, uh, he might be following soon. Lagar Blaze Assault and Sir SPT out in the middle of the field. Seems they really love the field, and I wasn't wrong on Soviet Piggy. Taken out by JVT or Charlie Foxtrot. Let's see who is left. And it looks like we've got Londarts come from, Londarts and AC Slayer come from the north, and we've got Lagar S SBT and Blaze Assault coming from the west. Yeah, lots of sandbags. Or northeast, my bad. You let you guys know the radio here just to my face. And we just Sweet. lost. One of the three to the south and northeast. Uh, maybe near the lodger truck? I don't know if I just... No, that was a tree. Yeah, the owner, uh, east side. They're close. Uh, friendlies. I can see the radio here through the hole in my sandbags. Oh. There's a uh, fire shelter in here as well. Yep, eyes on. Jeez. Is that guy near the lodge truck? He's in. He's in it. There's a guy. Blondar's taken out. Slayer was taken out by Hedda in the truck. No, I swear we made that. Eh, eh, whatever. Alright, looking at the last man alive for the Russian side, Lagar. I'm sure he can do it, I've only called his name out at least five times. Nope, apparently not. Nick of time gets him. And with that, I do believe that is... Waiting for the call.
still waiting on the call. Who are we waiting on? Yeah, I see that, Sasa, but uh, I think our event admin may have fallen asleep. <laughs> There it is. All right. GG for round two. Operation Chainlink.